Hello world, Becca here from Inside the Square with another CSS tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to create an outline text effect using CSS. As always, the code is beneath the video, so let's go ahead and copy and paste that and I'll show you how to apply it to your site. On your main menu, select Design, and then head on down to Custom CSS. This is where we'll paste the code that's beneath this video. And you can see right away, my heading one just updated to be outlined only. I'm gonna remove that code so you can see again, this is what it looked like before, and this is what it looks like after. Now the first part of this code is the H1, and that's telling the website that what I wanna change is the heading one type of text. You can update this to change to H2, which you'll see now updated the heading two in my example here on my demo site, or heading three, and if you want to do this to normal paragraph text or body text, just change that to the letter P and that will update. All right, sticking with the H1 because that's my biggest font and the easiest to read, let's break down this code really quickly. The color here is set to transparent and that gives us this outline effect. You can change that to a different color if you'd like. So if you'd like it to have an outline in one color and the fill of the text be a different color, change the word transparent to your hex code. I'll throw in one of my favorite colors here just so you can see this is an example. Now we have a solid color on the inside and a different color for the outside. All right, after that, we have the two pixel width. That's the actual width of the outline itself. You can change that down to one to make it even thinner, make it up to four or five. But as you can see here, my font's kind of thin. So the bigger I make that stroke width, the closer it is to actually filling in the text. Two is a good general number that I like to work with, but whatever fits your brand style, that's where you edit that part. All right, and then the last piece of the code is the actual color of the outline itself. So I'm gonna go ahead and set this code back to transparent. And then here we can actually change this to my favorite color again, and you can see that's where the outline color itself changes. So again, uh, it's this first part of the code is H1. That's identifying that this is the heading one type of text that we're going to be changing. You can change this to H2, H3, or the letter P for normal paragraph text. After that, we have the actual color of the font itself set to transparent, giving us this outline look. After that, we have the width of the outline itself, the pixel width. And then after that, we have the actual color of the outline. Alrighty, again, the code is beneath the video. Oh yeah, and when you're all done, Make sure you select save, most important part. All right, that's it for today's tutorial. Have fun with your Squarespace website. If you liked this tutorial, you'll love my CSS cheat sheet. Take your design skills to the next level. Download it now at insidethesquare.co slash CSS.